go! Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Let's be clear. The unknown gunmen killing people in the southeast are heroes. Let's be clear. The unknown gunmen killing people in the southeast are heroes. Sales Charles Soludo. So my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. The Anambra State Governor, Charles Soludo, has stated that the unknown gunmen causing mayhem in the southeastern part of Nigeria are some criminals among Igbo people. Soludo made the statement while declaring a curfew in the state over the recent attacks that left many people dead. According to Governor Soludo, his government will not fold its hands and watch some criminals terrorizing the state. He alleged that the prime target of these criminals is an Ambro state because it is the most lucrative location for kidnapping and robbery. Soludo added, that the security situation in the southeast continues to deteriorate because the sponsors of these terrorists are not in Nigeria. They sent them money and weapons from abroad. Let us be very clear. These criminals causing mayhem in Anambra Halbate of disparate groups and gangs are heroes dominantly from other southeast states whose real object whose real objective is lucrative criminality and foisting their idolatrous religion in on the region, he added. Unfortunately, every criminal gang, including court groups claims to be a liberation movement, making it difficult to differentiate between any genuine legitimate from criminals. Unfortunately, also, the criminals now dominate the space. What has agitation got to do with kidnappings? including kidnapping of priests of God, invasion of churches and tabernacles, including desecration of the altars of God. Why is it that everywhere they gather and in every camp they operate, there is a deity idol to which they routinely offer blood in sacrifice? From account of those kidnapped and later freed to stench of dead bodies in the camp's cry up to heaven. We see videos of them and their idol worship. We note that their threats to priests and bishops including threatening to take over some churches. The Anambra State Governor Charles Soludo has stated that the unknown gunmen causing mayhem in the southeastern part of Nigeria are some criminals among Igbo people. 
Soludo made the statement while declaring a curfew in the states over the recent attacks that left many people dead. According to Governor Soludo, his government will not fund its end and watch some criminals terrorizing the state. He alleged that the prime target of these criminals is an umbrella state because it is the most lucrative location for kidnapping and robbery. Soludo added that the security situation in the southeast continues to deteriorate because the sponsors of these terrorists are not in Nigeria. They sent them money and weapons from abroad. Let us be very clear. These criminals causing me am in Anabra. All bait of disparate groups and gangs are Hebrews, dominantly from other southeast states, whose real objective is lucrative criminality and foisting their idolatrous religion on the region. Unfortunately, every criminal gang, including court groups, claims to be a liberation movement, making it difficult to differentiate between any genuine agitators from criminals. Unfortunately, also, the criminals now dominate the space. What has agitation got to do with kidnappings? Included kidnapping of priests of God, invasion of churches, and tabernacles including desecration of the altars of God. Why is it that everywhere they gather, and in every camp they operate, there is a deity idol to which they routinely offer blood in sacrifice? From account of those kidnapped and later freed the stench of dead bodies in the camp's cry up to heaven, we see videos of them and their idol worship. We note that their threats to priests and bishops, including threatening to take some churches. To my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section and let us know what your view is all about.